Katie's <laughs> prolific start with the Nets. Oh. So much we could talk about here. Nets beat the Clips. KD drop an easy 28 points. Durant, fast, the second fastest to reach 500 points in just 17 games. So he's second fastest no. behind Wilt Chamberlain. Hey, Nick, our offense is our defense, buddy. <laughs> I like that. Brandon, Brandon, KD, the greatest third option in NBA history. <laughs> <laughs> oh. A great story out of New England. The perfectly named aircraft bringing 76 healthcare workers oh. representing all the New England states down to Tampa. All expenses paid courtesy of the Kraft family. This is the same plane that went to China and picked up a million masks when masks were in short supply and brought them over. So it's a nice bookend to bring masks and now bring vac vaccinated workers down to the Super Bowl. That's so awesome. congratulations, Driver Kraft. Also, side note, Thank this will also be the same plane that picks up Deshaun Watson and brings him to Foxborough and will be used on Deshaun Watson's <laughs> vacations. I knew, I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. Speaking of the Super Bowl, guys, Bucks found out yesterday they will not be allowed to set off the traditional touchdown cannons at Raymond James Stadium. Too much of a home field advantage. Right. So just so I understand this, the Bucks can sleep in their own beds, eat home-cooked food, change in their own locker room, train at their own facility, hang out with their whole family, shop at their own grocery store, use their, all their own hair products, have access to their entire wardrobe. But the cannons? <laughs> too far! Too much of a home field advantage. We cannot allow that. This right here is where we draw the line. Then it becomes an unfair advantage. Nick, I don't buy it. <laughs> I don't see it. There's too much sway in the other Different way. Products. <laughs> yeah. Hey, folks. That's on TV. Jenna made a joke of this story. Tried to show the lighter side. I will not do that. It is outrageous, concerning, and raises a lot of problematic issues that the Bucks thought they could do this. Tampa, this is not a home game for you. This is not, you guys are not the home team here. In fact, I believe you're technically the road team, and I don't think you should be in your home locker room. You should be in the visitor's so locker room. Out. It is some odd oh, great work that's never happened before where you actually get to host the Super Bowl. No, you don't. First of all, if it was based on anything about accomplishments, you won 11 games, the Chiefs won 14. You played each other, the Chiefs won. So if anything, this game should be moved to Kansas City. But they're not going to do that. So it happens to be in Tampa. Uh, congrats, everybody. Third best city in Florida is getting the Super Bowl. But if you guys try to fire your stupid cannons when you score a touchdown, the game is played under protest. It should be a 15-yard penalty for every cannon firing. I applaud applaud the NFL for stepping in. I'm now anxious about if they're going to do the old Patriot thing, mess with the headsets. This is not a Tampa home game. Get that Bucks logo oh, off center cannon. field. No, it's a game it that's is. played in it Tampa. Technically Zip is. it with your stupid cannons. It is technically not, actually, <laughs> Jenna. It technically is a neutral nope. site game, and I can't believe they even nope. requested their cannons. All right, well, Dusty it. has Very texted nice. me 27 times that... Yeah.